Elon Musk has a bold vision for Mars that could be the most daring journey ever taken by humanity. The groundwork for this project has already started. While some might see it as a perfect dream, others might view it as a nightmare. But really, it's a glimpse into the future as Elon Musk sees it. This vision took shape in 2016 when Elon Musk unveiled a massive rocket designed specifically to transport large groups of people from Earth to Mars. The original idea behind SpaceX in 2001 was to send a greenhouse to Mars. This would show life growing on another planet and inspire people to think about space travel. However, that wasn't quite the right approach. People have always been fascinated by space exploration. They didn't need a reminder that space is interesting. They needed a real spaceship to take them there. In a 2014 interview with Khan Academy, Elon Musk revealed, I thought there wasn't enough desire, but there was plenty if people saw a feasible way. So I decided to work on creating that way. After a decade of continuous updates and redesigns, the Interplanetary Transport Project took off with the manufacturing of prototypes starting in 2019, now named Starship. In April 2023, we witnessed the first major launch of a complete Starship Super Heavy rocket. By November 2024, SpaceX successfully managed controlled landings of both the main ship and its booster rocket. By 2026, SpaceX aims to send at least two Starships to Mars, attempting the first Mars landing. In November 2024, Elon expressed strong confidence, saying, I am highly confident we can send several unmanned Starships to Mars in two years. If these don't end up making more craters on Mars, then manned ships will follow in four Y years. It's likely that initial attempts might not succeed, but that's part of the process. We're watching these plans develop live. The Starship is solid proof of Elon Musk's serious commitment to this mission. SpaceX is on its way to Mars. So, what happens when we actually arrive on Mars? Elon Musk has plans for this too, although they're not as straightforward as the plans for getting there. His plan involves integrating the achievements of all the businesses he started over the last 25 years, and it all converges on Mars. A key part of this plan is Tesla, set to mark the first major merging of his ventures. When asked about the first items to be sent to Mars aboard Starship, Elon simply said, Cybertrucks and Optimus robots. By now, most people are familiar with the Cybertruck. It's a robust vehicle and looks just right for the harsh Mars landscape, which is rocky and full of debris from asteroid impacts and volcanic activity over billions of years. For such tough terrain, a durable and powerful vehicle like the Cybertruck is essential. Then there's the Optimus, or Tesla Bot, a newer project that has seen significant investment from Elon. The goal is to create a robot that can perform many human tasks, both in physical ability and intelligence. Optimus, envisioned first for Mars, is designed to be the first settler, using its capabilities to start building the infrastructure needed for human survival on Mars. Sending humans to Mars is risky, and Elon has been upfront about the dangers. He mentioned in a 2021 interview that some people might not survive. He described space travel to Mars as dangerous and uncomfortable, with a real possibility that those who go might not return. Yet, he also speaks of it as a magnificent adventure and a phenomenal experience, emphasizing the historic nature and the thrill of such a mission. Imagine a pen that doesn't just write perfectly, but also magically hovers and spins gracefully on your desk. This is what the hover pen from Novium offers. It's not just a pen. It's a piece of futuristic art crafted to inspire creativity and innovation. The Hoverpen Interstellar is designed to float at a precise 23.5 degree angle, mirroring Earth's axial tilt, and comes in striking finishes like Space Black and Mars Magma. It's designed to last a lifetime with its refillable feature, earning it accolades from Time Magazine as one of the best inventions of 2022. For those looking for something extra special, the Premium Edition includes a genuine 4.5 billion-year-old meteorite shard, a true piece of space history. 
If you prefer fountain pens, the Hover Pen Future is perfect, offering a dual function tip for both fountain and rollerball use. For the ultimate Hover Pen experience, the Interstellar gift set provides everything you need, including the Hover Pen, a sleek aluminum dock, and tools to make your workspace a model of efficiency and style. Whether as a gift or for yourself, the Hover Pen is a timeless selection. And now, Novium is offering my viewers a 10% discount on all Hover Pens with free shipping to most countries. Just use the code T-E-S-L-A-S-P-A-C-E -S at checkout. Scan the QR code on the screen and follow the links in the description below. Prepare to transform your writing experience with the Hover Pen a product as inspiring as the cosmos itself. Bringing more robotic automation and artificial intelligence to Mars greatly increases the chances of survival there. This is why Elon Musk has also started his own AI company. Through XAI, Musk is developing a new advanced language model named GRO. The goal for GRO is to evolve into what is known as artificial general intelligence. AGI, which is essentially a digital version of the human brain capable of learning, creating, and solving problems independently. GRO could essentially become the central brain for a Mars colony, providing a crucial resource for those living on the red planet who face up to a 20-minute delay in communications to Earth. This means if the Mars settlers need immediate assistance, they cannot rely on Earth for a quick response, but GRO could step in to help right away. This is where Elon Musk's most unusual company, Neuralink, comes into play. If humans on Mars will rely heavily on robots and AI for survival, it makes sense to connect their brains directly to these systems. Neuralink is a brain-computer interface that works by opening the skull, inserting tiny wires into the brain's outer layer, and connecting them to a small computer chip. This chip turns brain waves into computer inputs, Elon often talks about merging the human mind with AI. On Earth, this idea might sound unsettling, but on Mars, it could be a matter of life or death. For example, instead of sending a person out into Mars' dangerous environment to repair a solar panel, you could use Neuralink to control a humanoid robot and let it take the risk. Or, in an emergency, why spend time searching for critical information when you could instantly access the entire knowledge of humanity directly in your brain? So, let's imagine people safely land on Mars using their starship. When they arrive, they find a fully operational base maintained by Tesla bots, explore the rocky surface in Cybertrucks, and rely on brain implants and artificial intelligence to survive in a harsh, isolated world far from Earth. What happens next? Elon's vision is to build a self-sustaining city on Mars. This city would house 1 million people and require 100 million tons of supplies transported from Earth using 1,000 Starship rockets. But to build such a city, heavy machinery will be needed. This is where the Boring Company comes in. On November 14th, 2024, Elon Musk posted on X, tunnels will be important on Mars. And the boring company replied, Proof Rock fits nicely in the Starship payload bay. Proof Rock 4, their latest tunneling machine, can launch directly into the ground and start digging without any site preparation. Life on Mars will demand strong protection from extreme elements like radiation, micrometeorites, thin atmosphere, and massive dust storms. While giant glass domes might look cool in science fiction, they won't hold up to Mars' planet-wide dust storms, which happen every three years. But these storms would make underground tunnels a far more practical solution for survival, and Elon understands this well. At a 2017 conference, Elon explained how tunnels could be the key to building underground habitats on Mars. These tunnels would provide radiation shielding and safety, while allowing the creation of entire cities below the surface people could still go outside when needed, but living underground solves many challenges that Mars presents. With the right technology, Elon envisions digging tunnels not just for survival, but also for mining resources like ice, essential for a sustainable Mars colony. 
When discussing how the boring company connects to his Mars plans, Elon Musk explained, I do think getting good at digging tunnels could be really helpful for Mars. Building underground habitats with good radiation shielding. You could build a whole city underground if you wanted to. He added that while people would still want to go outside occasionally, tunnels would allow for a tremendous amount of construction underground with the right technology. Elon also noted that Mars's boring machines would need to be optimized differently from Earth's, as they would likely play a huge role in mining ice and other resources needed for survival. However, there's a critical question we need to answer. Who's in charge? If a million people are to live on Mars, they will need a government, leadership, laws, and a constitution to ensure order. Right now, this isn't part of Elon's plan, but starting in January 2025, Musk is expected to have significant influence within the United States government, which could spark big ideas for governing Mars. It's likely we'll see updates on this question very soon. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more amazing content about space, technology, and the future of humanity. Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Do you think Elon Musk's vision for Mars will become a reality? Stay tuned for more updates, and we'll see you in the next video.